All right, so there are some clarifications that I need to make for the uh, exam. Uh, we have, you're going to have 76 multiple choice. And you're going to have nine, you have 12 short answers, okay? 76 multiple choice, 12 short answers. Um, everything else applies uh, according to the, the audio review that you listened to earlier this week. But the clarifications that I need to make are on the, the written part. All right, so uh, make sure you review the effect of cell size on cells. Effect of cell size on cells. Uh, you're also going to have to compare and contrast solutions and suspensions. Solutions and suspensions. You're going to have to compare a unicellular organism with a multicellular organism. Unicellular organism, compare that with a multicellular organism in terms of cell specialization. Another Another, um, another short answer or science skill is going to show you the picture of the chloroplast where you have uh, photosynthesis taking place, you know, the light dependent reactions, the Calvin cycle, and you have to uh, answer a series of questions about what the products and the reactants are. Should sound familiar. You're going to be given a picture of four displays of the cell cycle. Remember, the cell cycle consists of interphase, which has three parts, mitosis, which has four parts, and cytokinesis, which is the division of the cytoplasm. But in plants, it's different, right, because the cell plate develops. So you're going to have to recognize four different pictures and you're going to have to figure out whether it's anaphase, telophase, metaphase, okay, prophase. You might have to tell whether it's interphase or whether it's cytokinesis. It should be very simple for you because you did a whole project where you had to diagram items of mitosis, the cell cycle, which includes mitosis, interphase, and cytokinesis. Uh, so make sure you know the order. Okay, what comes first? PMAT, remember? PMAT stands for prophase, metaphase, anaphase, telophase. So if you give a picture and it asks you to put it in order, make sure you're able to do that, okay? Lastly, you want to review the metric system. Okay, review the metric system. You'll be given a chart. It'll give you various items already converted and all you'll have to do is answer three questions pertaining to the chart okay so it will have common common metric units and the only thing that you'll have to do is look at that chart and answer questions um, about the metric system maybe converting meters to centimeters or looking at kilo and how many kilos are in a um, or how many liters, you know, on a kiloliter, or something like that, okay? So a total of 88 questions. <coughs> the way the test is structured, same as you heard on the previous audio, uh, it is primarily, it's about 75-25. 75-25. 75 multiple choice, 25 uh, written, okay? And going back to that, previous question about unicellular compared to multicellular organisms, it was in relation to how cells specialize.